This is the second generation VW Phaeton that never got built. Never before seen photos of a planned successor to Volkswagen's flagship luxury sedan show what could have been had the first Phaeton found more success. Much like the horse-drawn carriage with which it shared a name, the Volkswagen Phaeton faded into the fog of history after just one generation. But as Volkswagen celebrates 20 years since the luxury sedan's initial debut at the 2002 Geneva Auto Show, the company is now releasing never-before-seen photos of the second-generation Phaeton that might have been. Sold in the U.S. from 2004 to 2006, the first-generation Phaeton was eventually discontinued globally in 2016. At that point, Volkswagen says, a successor known as the Phaeton D2 was already in the works, but it never came to pass. What you see here is a concept version of the D2 model. At first glance, the new Phaeton is characterized by longer, sharper lines than the original, and it foregoes the round, doe-eyed taillights of the previous generation for narrower, angular ones. On the inside, generous wood and chrome accents give the D2 a similar feel to the original. But the use of quilted upholstery throughout, a curved glass display, and sleeker styling update the lounge-inspired interior for the modern day. That curved display eventually was used in the third-generation Touareg, which also never made it to the US. The Phaeton's rear seats also feature two entertainment screens mounted on the headrests. While the company didn't release much in the way of specs for the Phaeton D2, the concept was based on the Volkswagen Group's MLB platform, used for many Audi models and the Porsche Macan. In an alternate universe, maybe we would have seen the shiny new Phaeton riding down the highway alongside those cars, but for now, we're left with a glimpse at a hypothetical luxury Volkswagen that never was.